first here in the second half, and they trail as we get back underway. Fielded near the back of the end zone. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Costs him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. 20-yard line. The Charger drive about to get going. They're down three touchdowns to this point, needing to put something together as they have it first and ten. From the shotgun, here's Herbert escaping the pressure right. Wide open, it's Allen complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. The catch and run going to wind up netting him 33 yards. A shotgun snap for Herbert. Got a man over the middle, it's Williams. Touchdown, L.A. Mike Williams, 47 yards. And the Chargers, they're able to cut into that deficit. That's the score you felt they had to have here in the third quarter to get back in this game. And you know that there's an emphasis on their side. Hey, we know this. We know where we are. But sometimes that binds you up so much that you try too hard, you don't get the score. A perfect combination of urgency, yet relaxed enough to get it done. Extra point by Badgley, up and good. And that cuts the lead to 28-14. Long now will kick it away following the touchdown. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And no chance to get away as they'll get him down at about the 17-yard line. The Baltimore offense at the line set to get going. Their lead down to two scores after the touchdown a moment ago as they start with a first and ten. The drive will commence run by J.K. Dobbins. And not a whole lot to speak of there as they'll bring him down shy of the 20. Kenneth Murray, the linebacker, will make the play defensively. The second down attempt there, knocked down as it leaves the quarterback's hand, and it's incomplete. Well, you most certainly don't want to go three and out here and give the football right back because your friend, Old Momentum, he's wondering if he should change sidelines about right now. And if you don't convert here, guess what? He's going to make the trek to the opposite side, and all of a sudden, you've got a battle on your hands. Oh, looking for Andrews downfield. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. Derwin James with a pick, and he will return this one to the 30-yard line. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Well, I tell you, you can't fault the pass protection here. He had all day to throw, and he just couldn't find anywhere to go with the football. And quarterbacks will tell you that after a while, they start getting antsy back there. So this is just a great job defensively to stay with these receivers as long as they did. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. A gain there of 12 yards and a first down L.A. Herbert will give this one to Eckler. And they'll lose yardage here. Knocked back to the 19-yard line. Two yards the loss, second and 12. It's a loss of two. Brings up second and 12. At the Raven, Herbert. Flush to his right. His throw caught at about the five. And he'll be out of bounds about a half to a full yard shy of the five. The pickup goes for 13 and sets him up first and goal. Throwing quickly, and Herbert completes it. And he takes it in for a Charger touchdown. From six yards away. And the Chargers capitalize on the short field as they take it in for six. He's got it, and they're back within a touchdown at 28 21. 28. Chargers 21. Long now will kick it away following the touchdown. This taken in about four yards deep. And only able to get this to the 19, so probably should have opted for the touchback. Do that, do that, do that. Do that. The Ravens.
Raven offense set at the line for this next drive. Pretty important third quarter drive for them. Momentum has sort of shifted the other direction after that last touchdown as they nurse this small lead. J.K. Dobbins, the one he was looking for. But it's going to be second down. It certainly didn't appear that that's where he wanted to go with the ball initially, so he tried to get something out of it by dumping it off to his running back unsuccessfully. Third quarter of a tight football game as we come up on a second and ten. A shotgun snap and a give to Dobbins. He'll be dropped at the 25 after a gain of six. Frustrating for a defense, energizing for an offense. Finding a way to create that type of yardage in your running game, that'll make the guys carrying the ball very, very happy. Here's Jackson from the gun on third down. And that is incomplete. And that's a really good job there defensively. They went into this possession knowing that they needed to get a stop. They're in a tight ball game, and they got it done. Great work to force the three and out. Got the football right back for their offense. They've got to go to the sidelines feeling pretty good about themselves and encouraging their offensive mates to get some points. Here we go on fourth down with Jackson. And they will not be able to hook up there. It's incomplete. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And the Chargers will get the football back in excellent field position. Running on first down, Eckler. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play there. Second down. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. We're in Baltimore, third quarter action, second and ten. Now the option, here's Herbert. And he's going to lose yards. They take him down at the 26. It'll go as a loss of a yard, so now they deal with third and 11. Going to throw on third down with Herbert. Forced out to his left. Open man is Taylor. He's got it. And he is going to have the Chargers first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Good coverage downfield led to him taking off, picking up the first down on a 13-yard run. display of powerful running but it takes him only to the seven he's dropped there six yards there on the keeper it's second down brings up second and four on second down Eckler and he takes it in for a charger touchdown taking it in from seven yards away and the Chargers are an extra point away from tying this thing up. That almost looked too easy, and I think thanks goes to the offensive line for making it look easy. Yeah, I agree with you totally on that one. I'm not sure how much everyone understands the preparations that go into a game for an offensive line because there's a reason that running backs and quarterbacks give them big gifts at the end of a season after a big year. The consistency and the continuity it takes to know each other and execute their blocks is pretty impressive. Extra point by Badgley up and good. And an important one that is as we are all tied now early in this fourth quarter. So right back to square one, tied at 28 as he kicks it away. Taken in the end zone. And he'll just sit on this one as their drive will start at the 25. The Baltimore offense at the line set to get going. Well, they just gave up the score to tie it. That's the bad news. The good news, plenty of time in this fourth quarter to try to grab that lead back. And incomplete on the deep ball. Des Bryant, the intended receiver. But it'll be second down. Oh, 
Now a carry for Dobbins. And he's upended after a gain of two out to the 27. Well, that's a good start to this drive on the defensive side of the ball. And 4C in completion on first down. Then you're able to shut down the running play on second. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised now. A little bit of pressure going at the quarterback in the expected passing situation. Ravens on third down, two for five to this point. This is third and eight. Off the play fake to Dobbins, here's Jackson. And a big loss here as he's taken down. The sack by big number 98, Linval Joseph. Well, how about that? A dime set on defense, six defensive backs. None of them blitz. They're just back there in coverage. Defensive lineman gets the sack. That's where the O-line, they go to the sideline, they keep the, their helmets on so the cameras can't find them, right? Yeah, the cameras can't find them, but I know one thing, the O-line coach will. A very nice punt that time, but they get 11 back on the return. And it'll be Charger football here as they take over. The Charger drive about to get going. Excellent job by their defense to force the punt and provide them with this opportunity all tied in the fourth quarter. Now he's going to swing this one out to his running back. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. It'll be a gain of 10 to start the drive out by a few inches. That'll be a first down. Taken down right around the 41-yard line. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. That was a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. Once more, here's Eckler. And he's going to be down close to a first down at the Ravens' 35. They get six on the pickup there as the drive will continue. They were not fooling around at all, were they? Second and short, and they brought out that heavy package. Almost felt like the super heavy package against that defense, didn't it? Yeah, I don't think they expected that much beef up front, and it turned into an easy first down conversion. Getting down to the good stuff. All tied with two minutes remaining on EA Sports. On the ground, it's Eckler. And a short gain down to about the 33. The tackle made by L.J. Ford. I like it. I like the call. Still an opportunity to run the football and chew up a little more time off the clock. Heckler. And he'll go down at the 28. Give him six yards on the carry. It's going to be third and three now. Try to pick up the first with Eckler. And he will have a first down at about the 21-yard line. An effective seven-yard third down conversion. Now the Ravens going to use one of their timeouts as they get it with 26 seconds to go in the football game. They show run with three tight ends here on first down. gain of four on first and that'll make it second down we can't be totally sure that that was by design but we do know that a lot of kickers like the ball in the right hash in order to kick the field goal going on the ground with Eckler 
And they'll bring him down at the 13-yard line. Ravens going to use their third and final timeout as they stop it with 14 seconds to go in the game. On third down, here's Eckler. And boy, he is very close to a first down, but from where they're spotting that football, he's going to be a foot or so short. Give him a yard on the play, and he's definitely short. It'll be fourth down and a few inches. And we are set for a great finish as that timeout comes in with two seconds to go in this football game. So everything hanging in the balance, resting on the right foot of Michael Badgley. This one's over. It's in the win column for the L.A. Chargers. And they were buoyed, Charles, by a big second half that put this one on ice. So you get the sense that whatever was said at halftime obviously hit home. I think it's a little bit more than that, though. Obviously, there are words that are said, and, hey, come on, guys, we have to play better. But sometimes it's just sharpening your execution, sharpening your focus, and maybe doing the things you practiced all week without major adjustments, just doing them better. And that got it done in this one. That'll do it for us, for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. From Baltimore, so long, everybody.